okay, the more I talk about DK Oldies and their prices, the more I want to drink bleach. But I'm going to compare them now to Lukey Games. Lukey Games is another site that sells pretty much the same stuff as DK Oldies does, but their prices apparently are more fair. There are some expensive items on Lukey Games, yes, but are they a scam? Are they doing the same thing as uh, DK Oldies is doing? No, they're not. They're not making fake TikTok videos about, you know, how they refurbish and they don't. Blah, blah, blah. You know how it is. I don't want to repeat myself in every video. So we're going to do this now. We're going to look at a... We're going to do the same thing I did with the eBay video. Let's look at... Let's go with Nintendo 64 again. Here we go. Nintendo 64. Nintendo 64. So... Luki Games has a very big variety. I do know that Luki Games does have items that DK Oldies does not have. Um, here we go. Alright. Right off the bat, we have, first on the list here, $99.95 for just an original. You know, it has a third-party controller, okay. This and that, it looks great. The only thing, can we zoom in? On a, we can't zoom in on the picture, but whatever. Good reviews from actual customers. No fake, you know, reviews or anything like that. It looks good. Let's look at the other N64s that they have. Uh, Hurry up. Where are we going? <laughs> Why is it not doing... Okay. I like the colored N64s. Okay. I do like these green, blue, red, pink, whatever these are. Um, they're not the cheapest, but they're nothing compared to DK Oldies. Now, yes, yes, I do see an item on DK Oldies cheaper than Lukey Games. As you can see, I do see that right here. But, but, you're getting probably better quality on Lukey Games than DK Oldies. The difference is, you know, their player packs and they're the way they say they refurbish and they come out of the box dirty. It just don't seem right. Now, here, <laughs> discounted, Oh, Now, let's look at, DK Oldies doesn't have the colored ones, do they? Yeah, they do. Yeah, they do. And they're out of stock. Look at that. Okay. Let's look at. I'm trying to see a good comparison. Bear with me here. Hmm. All, all right, here we go. Expansion pack. Can I find one on here? Can I find one on here? Come on, hurry up. Uh, I don't see... Uh, I don't think DK Oldies has this. Original N64 console with expansion pack for only $218. That doesn't... I mean, the only thing that sucks about the Wiki games... I can't zoom in on the fucking... Photo. <laughs> I can't. Now, there's one bad review. Very clean and work, works well. Why is that one star? I don't get that. But overall... The quality on Wiki games is better. From what I've seen. There has been other people reviewing these. So, bear with me. I'm not perfect. But... Let me see PlayStation. There is a very expensive item on Luki Games. Ve even more. Even more expensive than DK Oldies has. I, I will I maybe I might show that. I don't know. It wouldn't be fair because the Luki Games has it and DK Oldies doesn't have it. So I can't compare. Because if they don't have the same thing, I'm not gonna compare the two. Like this. PlayStation 2. Oh, wait, I'm on PlayStation 1. What the fuck am I doing? 159, 137. Again, I had this comparison before with eBay. Not big difference. Not a big difference. But here's the thing. People are reviewing the consoles, unboxing them from DK Oldies, and it says good condition system. And the system is not refurbished. It's not opened. It's not cleaned. It's dusty. Third-party controller... And it's just not, it's false advertising. Here, and we have one discounted, look. But it has a third-party controller, and that's fine. Look at this. PS1, look at this. $85 for the PS, 
one mini. They had one of these back in the day. They're actually decent. So, again, happy customers. That's not bad for that price. Does DK Otis has this? Yeah, fuck off, assistant. I don't care about you. How can I help you today? Ugh. Whatever. Do they have a mini? I don't see a mini. Uh, I'm not going to go through 213 pages of this. I'll just say they don't have a mini. <laughs> fuck them. Xbox. Xbox. Let's go. Alright. Now, these aren't the cheapest prices I've ever seen. But look at the variety difference between Luki games here. Look at these different... Look at this. All green Xbox. All green. Mountain Dew Edition. And yes, that's 13, and it's out of stock anyway. They have decent, and they're out of stock. All the good ones are out of stock. So they're doing good. What does, uh, <laughs> what does, um, DK Otis have to offer? I don't see anything special. I don't see anything that's, that's just eye popping at all. It's just a regular console for 260. How boring is that? You can go here. You can go here, and it's a shame it's out of stock. You could spend a little more on a limited edition console. Even, like, look, 262. Halo version. Okay. This isn't the base, boring, basic console. This is the it's a special edition. All right. So some of their prices are similar, I have noticed. But they're not scamming people like DK Odie does. So, we're going to... I don't know what else to compare it to. Because I have done this so many times. Um, let me see. Let me see what the hell they have here. They have a lot more than DK Oldies. I can tell you that. They have toys. You imagine DK Oldies selling these? <laughs> yeah, DK Oldies would sell this stuff for like... They would put it in the box. For like, like a little plush Mario. DK Oldies would be like... That'll be thirteen hundred hours plus the Mario game. Do they have toys here? Oh yeah, they do have toys on these, don't they? Let me see. Yeah, they got toys. I'm wrong. Not much. I mean, in their refurbished department, somebody commented, "Refurbished doesn't mean clean." Yes, it does. Refurbished means clean. Dust, scratches. I mean, I know GameStop likes to sandpaper their consoles. I don't know why they do that with refurbished. That's a weird thing to do. And I've said that before in my other video. So, yeah, comparing Luki Games to DK Odie's, Luki Games has a very big variety. This isn't just about prices now. I'm not just, this is not just another price video. Look at the amount of, look at the amount of quantity and quality they have. Look at this. Look at all of this. What the hell do they have here? They have quality. Yeah. I mean, honestly, the selection here is more eye-popping than DK Oldies. It's more eye-popping. It like it it's much better looking on Luki Games. And they have all of this stuff. Look at this. 50 bucks for a Genesis 3. That's not terrible. Now this, yeah, you could say that's expensive. But it has everything included. DK Oldies would sell this for this price. You get it? You know what I'm trying to say? Genesis 2 console for 60 bucks. DK Oldies would sell this for at least probably 260 <laughs> and yes, you get third-party controllers. I think that's third-party controllers. But still, I choose Luki Games over DK Oldies. Rare and collectible. This is where the pricey stuff gets in. Now, Luki Games has a very large amount of expensive collectible rare stuff, apparently. DK Oldies, I don't think they do. They don't have this option. They put all... See, they categorize... The most expensive stuff on here. Look at this stuff. One thousand over a thousand dollars here. Eleven hundred out for this. I've never heard of this game. 
game only. You can say, oh, that's a ripoff. Again, I, okay, I'd never heard of this game. It's in a different selection area. So you don't get ripped off. You know that it's probably going to be expensive. DK Odies, they don't tell you that. They don't tell you, hey, this is rare. This is collectible. It's going to be expensive. Luki Games does that. I'm not saying Luki Games is cheaper than DK Odies. Not in all items. Look at all this. Look at this stuff. Now, I would not personally, I would not do, I would not buy any of this stuff for that price. You're crazy. But again, Luki Games has a better selection. Very big selection. All right. Rare, gold, and 64 system. I don't think DK Odies has that. DK Odies don't have a fucking virtual boy. They don't have this, do they? I don't know. Oh, I'm going to see. Maybe they do. I might be wrong. No, they don't have it. They don't have Virtual Boy. They do. You see? They have a shitload of things to buy. <laughs> DK Oldies has like a fucking... Their little fucking price pack... Their player pack things. I've never seen a game that expensive before. And it's sold out. So people are buying it. Luki Games gets points on... Pricing, majority of it's quality. I do have to say, the quality is better than DK Odie's. The pricing, a little more fair. Still can be expensive in some areas. But still, they're not going around on TikTok scamming people, telling you, oh, it's this, but then you get it and it's not. $2,500 for Panic Restaurant. What the fuck? But... Is this a rare game? I don't know. I have never heard of this. And somebody bought it, see? Somebody bought it back in 2013. So yeah, people are buying it. It's not like a scam, I guess. But, how? what is this game? Is it really worth that much? I don't know. But DK Odie's... Again, as much as this is here, they would sell this for at least probably like $10,000. Not going to lie. So yeah, Luki Games versus DK Odies. Luki Games wins when it comes to quality, quantity. And, um, you know, there's similarities in their prices, but it's not, like I said before. I don't want to keep repeating myself. Luki Games just, you know, isn't fake. You know... Again, they're two different companies. And, um, yeah, as you can see, there we have it, people. That is the Luki Games versus DK Odies. And Luki Games wins beyond. And they also have a bonus rare and collectible uh, selection here. I don't see that here. I just see retro deals. <laughs> and they're not deals at all. They're fucking ridiculous. Where's the rare and collectible button? Because when I see this, I know it's going to be expensive. I know when I click on this right here, it is going to probably cost me a lot of money. Where do I see that here? You know what I mean? So thank you for watching. Subscribe, like, and comment. Links in the descriptions below. Have a great day.